Welcome, in front of me is an Asus Zenfone 11 Ultra and today I will show you how you can hard reset this device through recovery mode. Now, before I get started, I'm going to quickly mention that this process allows you to get rid of a screen lock if you have one set that you don't know. Now, typically, uh, this will also most likely FRP lock your device because majority of us have a Google account sign in on a device. And I'm mentioning this because some people will want to do this and they might not know both screen lock or the Google account. And without knowing both of them, once you reset the device, you're just kind of stuck on the setup screen without ever being able to finish it up. And that being said, I would typically be recording a way to bypass this, uh, but didn't have time to look for it this time around with this device. So chances are there is a way to bypass this. And if you're really interested in such a thing, I uh, just look for my videos uh, when I was doing such a bypass but for the previous uh, Zen phone and chances are this will still work now going into the reset assuming you have screen lock or not you can just power off the device from the lock screen so hold power button select power off and when the device turns off you want to hold your power button and the volume up at the same time now once you see the boot mode you want to let go of the two buttons right away now one thing to to mention, sometimes when you let go of the power button, it accepts the first option, which is start. Uh, so basically power button is used to confirm whatever is selected, which start is, and it tries to boot you back into Android. So if you see this page just automatically close, go black. When you let go of the buttons, start holding them right away. And then try again. Now, uh, once this is open, you want to use volume buttons to select recovery mode, confirm it with the power button, give it a second and it will boot us into recovery mode. And once we have recovery mode open, again we will be using volume buttons to navigate up or down. And using those you want to select, wipe data, factory reset, confirm it with the power button, then select yes. And now can select reboot system now or just confirm it as it will be selected by default. So this will now continue resetting of the device in the background and on Asus it is a very quick reset so it's something like 20 to 30 seconds or so. So in just a moment we should have a uh, setup screen visible. And there we go. And it's already done. So anyway, with that being said, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.